Um, it's going to go quick. This is darling. Okay. And this is probably the closest to your hairstyle too. I think what a lot of people like. I mean, it's a great, like a really. If, if you have a really short hairstyle, yeah. absolutely. This is like oh, the Oh, wait, wait, I'm sorry. After. I just need to show you real quick. Can you just look at this real quick? Because it's really almost gone. So it, there's, your la there's your last look at it, most likely. There's the light gray. And you might as well just go real quickly. Black, um, black burgundy, black brown, dark brown, medium red brown uh, up here. I love that. Medium red ginger, medium brown ginger, medium brown gold, light brown medium golden blonde and then light golden blonde oh good there's the light gray yeah and here's the actual light gray and again this is not this isn't going to last very long but just to give only you 10 left yeah there you are all there right let's is. let's show them how we put it on i become a pro 38 minutes in <laughs> And now you've done this once or twice, right? So right. now you feel like it's, you know, second nature. Oh, and that's yeah, what so I tell easy. women, like, you know, don't try it for the first time when you plan on wearing it out the door. Take a little time and, you know, practice. Wear it around the house. Get really, really comfortable with it. And when you wear it around the house a little bit, you're going to, everything you do will have a little bit more of a spring in your step. You'll just feel better about yourself. It's like instant self-confidence. It's like Spanx. I feel the same way about those. You put them on, you feel better about yourself. You put on better hair. Those are better. those are also brilliant, Aren't right? They? I mean, this is Seriously. brilliant, and Spanx are brilliant. If you let's, have longer let's... hair, uh, like Christina does, you do the, the split, and then you just twist, and then you're good to go. Okay. So the, um, the let let me just take one second. I, mean, I know you're going to throw yours right on because you're a pro at this. 30, 39, 38 minutes in. But I want to point out for people who have not done this before or maybe didn't see the demo. Again, all I did was get my hair out of the way. Um, you have. Don't worry about this nonsense because it really doesn't matter. It tucks cute. right in. It's kind of cute. It's like yeah. my thing. Um, and then. You have a wig cap included in every one, so if you feel more comfortable and you want to wear a wig cap and just kind of tuck your hair right into that, that's fine. The idea is to try to keep your hair as flat to the head as possible. You don't want to create any bumpy areas. Oh now, my goodness, I, I look you, like my mother. <laughs> I wish she was watching right now. I should have called her before I went on. So what I would do is just pull this. See, this feels a, a little bit higher than your hairline, so I would pull it a little bit further down and kind of wear this like a little to the side like a cute pixie. Oh, that's and then so cute. bring these little pieces forward. So, you know, take a second and play with it and think about it. That's adorable. Like, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Yeah, Frank, so you cute. have to take a picture and text it to me so I can show my mom. This, she's this hair, this is, yeah, that, puff that's okay. Puff. So if that happens and you have hair that's yours, that's sticking out, all you have yours. to do is just tuck it right back in and you're done. Okay? It's like, no, it's good to go. So here's the thing. Let's talk about the construction of the wig. And that the reason why I want to emphasize the construction of the wig is because it's not the type of wig that you're gonna pick up on some shelf somewhere that you found in the middle of nowhere on a retail store that like feels and doesn't you know doesn't feel right these wigs are incredibly made by First the way of all, gray is gone I apologize <laughs> gray is sold out and more than 500 gone these are going quick there's this beautiful really luxurious little velvet patch right at the front this is the part that cushions your forehead okay right so that you're not gonna get itchy or scratchy do you ever see people that sometimes wear yeah. like itchy and scratchy that's not gonna happen here this is a lace construction at the top and it's got so much stretch I mean I wish like, let's do it in front of you because you can kind of see through it right into your dress oh, yeah. color you know what I mean it's got a lot of breathability that's what and, I mean to say and I know this is something funny and it's really hard to quantitate when you're at home and you're not touching anything but I have a very large actual cranium and I have a lot of hair, thick hair. The fact that these all fit on my head without hurting, without any of that, that was one of my concerns. And, and that was my problem with all other wigs is they would they hurt because my head's get a, too big and too much hair. And then you get a headache. So right. again, this is like a great pair of shoes, yeah. you know, that just really is well made and fits well. Okay, so this is also going to fit smaller size heads. So here's the thing at the back where the tag is, there's a hook and loop. These little hook and loops help you customize, extra customize, if you want to make it a little bigger or smaller, okay? Now, last thing I want to point out is on either side of this velvet patch, on the left, just to the left and just to the right, there are these triangular shapes. Can you see that right over here? This is a flexible tab, okay? The reason why you want to grab both of them at a certain point, and I'll show you when, is to make sure that your wig isn't on the wrong way. Some people put the wig on where the front isn't the front and the back isn't the back, and right. they go, they don't work for me, this looks awful. It's because it's gotta be centered, okay? So how do you do it? What you wanna do is use your forehead to hold the base where that beautiful velvet patch is, okay? And then once you, use, once you do that, you wanna give it 
a nice, you see I'm giving it a big, big stretch. You wanna get it all the way to the back, okay? Pull your ears out. People ask, I'm just gonna, you know, some people say, do I Make keep sure my your ears, ears are out? And, and it's not a weird question. So what you wanna do is take those ear tabs, help you find center, and because they're flexible, you wanna push them towards your um, temple area. Now you wanna make sure that the line of the wig is aligned with your hairline because that's what's gonna make it really feel natural to you. That's the most important is that it feels natural to you because when it feels natural to you, everybody else believes it. It's so, okay? it's so comfortable, it looks so, realistic and I mean I, I don't I even want to like say that because it is realistic this is truly you this is you with hair this is you with a different hairstyle that you didn't have to go out and spend money on to get you got this for four easy payments of $24.75 it's that simple change up your look feel better about yourself me not at work is no makeup and hair air dried maybe a little perfecter if I'm lucky this makes things so much easier take a look at your colors light golden blonde medium golden blonde, oh, fewer than 200 of those. Light golden blonde, me, fewer than 200. Medium golden blonde, and I have light golden blonde. Light golden blonde yeah. on, yes. Uh, light brown, fewer than 200, fewer than 200. Medium brown golden, medium red brown. 100 left, wow, medium red ginger. Last call, medium brown ginger. Black burgundy, black, oh, oh, black burgundy. Four that, dozen that left. The black with the burgundy highlight is gorgeous. gorgeous. Uh, less than four dozen, I think. Uh, black and then dark brown. Black is last call. Dark brown, 150 left. Revert your eyes from light gray. That's gone. Barbara in Kentucky. Barbara, what do you think? Barbara. Oh, I think they're beautiful. Don't you? Are you picking oh. up this one? I am picking up the textured wig. Uh -huh. Yes, I am. It's great. And I'm hoping that uh, from kind of good time, I'll pick up some more different ones. But right now, I thought this one looked beautiful. So you, this is your first time trying a hairdo? This is the first time I've purchased a wig from you guys. That's great. I'm so, you're, you're going to be so pleasantly surprised. It sounds like you've worn wigs, though, in the past. What are some of your complaints in the past, Barbara? Uh, I ordered, I mean, I uh, wore wigs in the past. Mm -hmm. And the biggest problem I had with it was being too tight on my head, mm -hmm. where they wasn't adjustable back in the 70s. Right. Uh -huh. And um, now, since this is adjustable, it won't be so tight, won't give you a headache. It's great. Um, I just think the wig just looks fantastic. It is. It's a um, great look. Yeah, I, yes, I, it is. I and think you'll be really pleased. Fun. Yes, I got a feeling I'm going to be tickle pink. <laughs> well, I'm so glad you were with us tonight. Please stay in touch. Let us know how it goes for you, okay? I sure will. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, Barbara. Thanks for calling. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. Uh, this is right. not the same color as me. This is the lighter color, right? Or are we the same? You guys are, are, you guys are uh, like hair color sisters. Yeah, hair and color so you can take a look and see how we've styled it a little bit differently, right? We've gone with like this sort of longer bang look over here. And for you, you know, you can really go through and create some movement in it. A lot of women really love to have that movement. This is going to listen to you. You know, as you pick this hair up, it stays. You can add hairspray and product right. if you'd like. You can also wash them in a cold water bath with a cap full of your favorite shampoo and that you're not going to diminish the quality of them. They don't run out and wear down quickly like a lot of other pieces. This is really going to last and last and last for you. You know what I love about these shorter looks? I know the fear of going from long to short. I did that once and then I never went back because I really liked short better than long, at least for me, on me and in my lifestyle, it just works better for me. But I know there's so many of you out there who have long hair that you always wanted, oh, short would look, would look good. Your husband says, oh, do short hair, whatever it might be, but you're afraid. Right. This is 24.75 on your major credit card with a 30-day love it or return a guarantee to try it and see how you feel and, and play with it and have fun and go out on a date night and do something different. And for those of you who do have short hair or have thinning hair or don't have this much hair that you can run your fingers through that just you feel more feminine and, and or you have a hard time doing the back of your hair, your hair is done for you. Yeah. And sometimes, let's face it, long hair doesn't match the outfit. Sometimes short hair just looks better with there certain things. There is attitude with short so hair. So feel, feel free to change up your look and feel free to dive out there and use your imagination to create beautiful looks, complete your outfit, just like the way you would with jewelry or shoes or an accessory, and you know create the look with your hair. Don't be afraid, go for it, because 
fashion permits that today. Yeah, it really does. This one is so popular. Let's go through the colors that you have to choose from in this one. Uh, the gray's already sold out. We're down to like the last hundred in most of the uh, of the color choices. And here they are, by the way. So there is the light golden blonde. That's the lightest. And look at the hue. I mean, there's seven to 11 different highlights in each, each one. So they're gonna match so well. There's medium golden blonde. There's light brown and they feel so good. So healthy, so yeah. rich, so thick, just wonderful. Me, uh, medium brown gold, medium brown ginger. That's awesome. Medium red ginger. I just love that. Can, can I interject just for one yeah, second? What I want to say, if we can go right back up here for one second, a lot of people ask me, what is medium brown gold, right? Medium brown is a medium brown as a base color. So the root and the base color, main color is medium brown. And then it has all of these beautiful golden highlights that open up into it. So if you love dimension in your hair and you're a highlighted girl that's naturally brown at first, mm -hmm. medium brown with gold is your color. Then you move and you can have a medium brown base with a ginger highlight. Look at the difference between those two. This looks a little bit warmer. They're both sun-kissed. This is warmth and this is more of a neutral, right? Well, it's got the gold in it, but right. not quite as warm as this ginger. So, so that's awesome. what I wanted to explain. Same thing with medium red ginger. You've got medium red with those ginger highlights. Seven to 11 different shades in all of these colors. And then down below in the last 20 seconds or so, we have... Medium red brown, the color that I'm wearing. We have dark brown, which is very close to black. So if you weren't able to get that, the dark brown is a beautiful, perfect dark brown color. This is the black base with the burgundy highlights. Then we have the black and unfortunately no Excellent. longer the light gray, but we hope to bring that back again. Four easy payments of $24.75 because we're busy. Automated ordering, qvc.com is your best way to go. Don't forget about the one time only we had just moments ago and don't go anywhere because we have the long look coming yeah. up. In it's just a fave, I gotta a say, it's a fave. All right, uh, he's got a